Hello, I'm Jason Ruckman, and I lead the HTML5 Embedded Development Team at B-Square. Today's brief video will highlight the performance potential of a HTML5-based solution on an embedded system. We are looking at a simulation of a user interface panel for an industrial automation solution. It is running on hardware typical of many embedded systems. It is important to note that we are not running this demo on a PC. We are running directly on a BeagleBoard XM, running a 1 GHz ARM A8 core with 512 MB of RAM. It is running the Windows Embedded Compact Operating System. The performance of this hardware is typical of what you would see in many modern embedded solutions. We are running HDMI video out from the development board to a monitor to display the actual UI for this demonstration, but it is also possible to configure the BeagleBoard with an onboard LCD. This UI provides some real-time information for key system parameters. Through this user interface, we can select different system simulations. As you can see, the animation of this HTML5 application is very responsive and fluid even though we are using an embedded system. This first screen we have been looking at was showing the normal behavior for the system. The second screen is for system calibration. You can see here that I am able to calibrate the system and then reactivate it again after the calibration is complete. And the last screen, the emergency panel, is showing a system fault condition. And after a few moments, it will start to show some more rapid changes for alerts, gauges, and dials. It's important to note that this type of fluid dynamic response does require careful development practices and optimization to achieve. Now let's go back to the stable system. Okay, great, things are back to normal again. We were able to improve the animation updates for the application over 55% through various optimizations on the platform. Carefully balancing the complexity of toolkits and scripts on the platform was essential. The B-Square embedded HTML5 team optimized this solution by evaluating the performance of various rendering options from the B-Square HTML5 rendering engine such as CSS3, HTML5 Canvas, and SVG for the application, and we chose the rendering that provided the best response without sacrificing too much in the graphical design. As you can see, HTML5 is a viable option for embedded devices. It can perform well, even on limited hardware, and deliver the rich experiences your end users have come to expect. Thank you for taking a look at this exciting new technology. For more information about how B-Square can empower your organization to quickly bring innovative embedded HTML5-based devices to market, please visit us at our website at bsquare.com or email our sales department or just call us directly.